Aviation Administration and the National Transportation Safety Board are handling the investigation, trying to figure out what caused the deadly plane crash here in Hamilton County. Investigators say the pilot was the only person on board when the plane went down around 1130 this morning. It happened here at the Indianapolis Metropolitan Airport in the Fishers area. The airport is off of 96th Street, not far from I-69. The FAA says the crash happened as a pilot was taking off, not during the landing as sources initially reported. We talked to a man near the airport who heard the crash. Other witnesses and fishers say they first noticed something was wrong when they saw a large plume of smoke. But I happened to look out because my dog was barking and there was rolling black smoke just beyond the tree line. Oh, we just saw the smoke. It was, I can't even begin to tell you how high the smoke was. It was just unbelievable. At first, I didn't think it was the airport, and then we saw that it was the airport. Again, the FAA and NTSB are the lead investigators. Indiana State Police will secure the scene until all of the federal teams arrive. From Fishers, Julie Persley, RTV6.